Hold on, I'm almost done. And it's like, Vega. A power and a force that you've never seen before. got the ability to morph and to even up the score. We're almost there, we're almost there, we're almost there. No one could ever take them down. The power lies on this. Then it's, you know, Go Go Power Rangers. Yeah, so we're playing, not Go Go Power Rangers, we're playing Power Rangers Mega Battle. I did the first part, there was no commentary, my voice was gone. My voice is kind of back a little bit, so I'm trying to ruin it right now. I'm getting another commentary video in. We're going to defend the city from the mall rescue. Rear attacks take down your enemies behind. You. I don't know why I'm awkwardly paused there, but... Yeah, so I saw the Power Rangers trailer today for the movie coming out in, like, March? And I gotta say, not... Not the biggest fan. Hold on. Scream is coming from that way. Let's go! The guy, okay, so you gotta do the hand motion. You gotta be, like, you know, like... Overly fucking excited. You're a, you're a Power Ranger, dude! Yeah, so I saw the... What the music, what music is this? Well, I, could, I know pretty much every single piece of Power Rangers music, like, original score. So I'm trying to see what this is remixed into. But so far, I can't tell? Oh, if you guys didn't notice, I am a, I am a massive Power Rangers nerd. Like, like I, I pretty much stopped with Mighty Morphin series, though. So, like, I know a little bit to, like, space. I call it the Zordon era. But, yeah, but, like, I know my shit, okay? So, uh... Like right now, this isn't canon. Be, being the White Ranger, come on, I'm playing the Green Ranger. But anyways, I saw the um the tra the trailer, and I was like, "What the fuck is this?" Like, I get it. You want to like, you want to be able to to like fucking uh, do something different and everything, but they made Power Rangers too serious. Like, who saw the trailer? It's like some weird like Transformers like aspect of them, I don't like it. Like, I feel like it doesn't have the campiness to it. And you need you need the campiness. You need the camp. Otherwise, just like, what, what are you doing this for? Well, like, they showed, like, Goldar, and he was, like, way, way too, like, he's, like, pure gold. I'm like, what the, what the shit is this? What's my blue dog, sometimes cat, like, Goldar? What is this shit? Like, and he's, like, a 90-foot already, like, tall monster, and, like, I didn't like the way the Megazords looked. What the fuck was what kind of Super Saiyan shit? What was that? Oh, hold on, wait, hold on, wait, hold on, hold on, wait. It looks like it's morphin' time. Come on, I did wrong, wrong button. Morphin', mor mor morphin' time. What the fuck is the morphin' button? Hold on. <coughs> Wait, it's morphin' time! Ha, <laughs> bitch! Yeah! See, I, I would hope that when he morphed into White Ranger, I would get the White Ranger theme song. Because we all know Tommy was the greatest the greatest of the Rangers, right? Like, that's not for debate. And he had the best theme songs. And I'm like, where, where's my White Ranger Tiger Power theme song at right now? Like, this is... Whoa, what the fuck is he doing? This is real, you guys. Like, I'm wearing my Green Ranger hoodie right now. This is happening. Like, this probably should have been the one time I went on camera, but I don't do that no more. But just take my word for it. I'm wearing my Green Ranger. What was that? That's like a kamikaze attack. I am wearing my Green Ranger jacket. Like, this is this is this is serious. Wait, we're gonna get the hot dogs, right? 
Yeah. But yeah, that movie, I'm like, I don't know. It's, it's not going to be better than the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers movie. It's, just, it's not. It's not. You know what I'm talking about. The one with Ivan Ooze. Or, or the one with Apocalypse in it. Let's like to call it. Because Apocalypse in the X-Men looks just like Ivan Ooze. And for some reason, don't ask me. Ask Fox. I love that original movie, though. I used to watch the shit out of that movie. That's when I learned about that, um... Uh, Red Hot Chili Pepper song. That's not listening to Devo for the first time. Cause like, no one really listened to Whipper. You just knew about it. But like, cause like the first guy. All right, so the very like beginning, the very very beginning of that movie. Well, I mean the very beginning of the movie. They, that's when they meet Ivan. He he comes out. But like when you meet the Power Rangers, they're in a airplane. Cause they're 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 skydiving for charity. Cause it was the '90s and teenagers could do that for charity, and no one no one. Would bat an eye, and they were extreme kids, you know. So like, no, we don't just fucking donate money or go on runs. We jump out of planes, and so the first song they play is uh, a Red Chili Pepper song, and then when Bulk and Skull try to come out, they play a uh, Free Ride. And that's the first time I heard a song Free Ride, but I knew like every word to that song because of that movie. I feel like I'm just giving you guys a play-by-play -play of like the. God, why are these putties? They're fucking putties. Why did they take so long to kill? It's supposed to be like two hits. Oh, that's why. I was supposed to destroy that. Like, who the fuck are you? Just some random ass person trapped inside. Shit. Oh, I can shoot back. Oh, I gotta jump on him. I gotta jump on him and attack. Let me take these assholes out first, though. Yeah, this is like, this is not music from the Power Rangers like TV show though. I would know. I am a Power Rangers music expert. Like, did you guys know the guy who composed it was named uh, uh, Ron Wasserman, aka the Mighty Raw? Bet you know that. No, that shit, did you? I, but I, I'm kind of curious what kind of music they're gonna use for the movie now because, you know, they actually like use like techno shit to like remix and stuff and I don't want that. There we go. Nope. I don't want that shit. I want the original. Or at the very least, use the remastered version that Ron Wasserman actually did. He did a remastered version of all the Power Rangers songs from the Mighty Morphin series. I'm like, that's super cool. You know? So use that shit. I don't want no like original soundtrack or nothing because it's going to suck. It's not going to compare. Okay, do I like punch this out? Who the fuck are you? You're just some guy saying hostage is rescued? I don't know who you are. Oh, I need to get some life real quick. I don't like the fact that shit. That like um uh, You have to like it's like on the same planes, you have to jump up to different planes, cause when you like kick him up like this, like kinda wait. Like, you kick him up like this, it's kinda hard to like combo them. Because you might either just end up jumping and like to the higher point or jumping and hitting them, you know what I mean? But this is a $15 game, so I'm not expecting too much. I just really love the Power Rangers, so like... Can I buy clothes? What? I can go inside the shops? Oh, for real? <coughs> but I can buy shit? No, I can't buy anything. I don't remember this Black Knight uh, being such a, a strong proponent opponent in Power Rangers history. Like, maybe he was a Sentai person, but, like, not my power, it just... I need him dead. He's fucking annoying. Dude, go away! I'm just shooking, shoot you guys. Aw, oh, shit, I can't shoot him. Oh, meet Saba, bitch! Shit. Like it's not, it's not, it's not, it's not really engaging fighting this guy. You have to do that shit. But it's kind of hard to do a follow up. There we go. How did your dumbass get captured? I right, this four more times. Can I buy close? No, I can't. Can I demorph? 
Wait, why do I want to demorph? I'm stupid. Let's get out of here. All right, bitch. See, like I'm missing like point blank because I'm like not on the same level as them. It's weird. But um, yeah, the original Power Rangers movie was a masterpiece. I mean, you had drama, Zordon, because like, Ivan Ooze was like the best Power Rangers villain. Because like all the other villains were like all about talking and shit. And like literally, Ivan Ooze, the first thing he does when he gets reawoken. He's like, alright, Rangers, you guys are kind of nothing to me, so peace out. Fight my little t my kids or whatever. I'm gonna go kill your boss. Can I go to the woman's bathroom? Yes, I can. And so he uh, he goes, he kills one. I mean, he, he not kills him because he's a kid, really, but like he, he he puts him on death's bed, you know? And so the power just gotta go and they gotta go to a different planet to get their powers. Fucking Jesus Christ, dude. Can I move to the left? Thank you. You guys even like worth fighting. It takes too many hits to kill you guys. It's your, your, your putties. That's it. That's it. That's it. So, like, they gotta go to a different planet. It's crazy. Because, like, they go to this planet. And they gotta fight fucking crows, man. Because, um... Ivan Ooze spit on the ground and made crows. You know, he had really undefined powers. I think about it. Like, he probably shouldn't have lost to them. But, um... So he, he sends his crow people out there, and they go they go to a different planet, and they meet this one lady, and she's like, oh, I, I need Zordon. And they're like, yeah, we gotta stop Ivan Ooze. And she's like, Ivan Ooze is a, is, a, is a bad person who must be stopped. And they're like, yeah, yeah, I know. And so then, like, she's like, who are you guys? And like, we're Power Rangers. And then she takes her bow staff, which just trips Tommy up, just, like, hits him right on the ground. And I'm like, that's not cool. Tommy wasn't doing anything wrong. And anyways, they, um, they meet up with her. I just beat your ass, didn't I? <coughs> they meet up with her, and she takes him to a special place that took like five hours to go to. Meanwhile, Ivan News is on Earth telling Kyrus to sell Ling to their parents, and the drugs will make him uh, subservient to him, and they would go and excavate his like giant ants and like giant wasp megazords. Listen, I didn't make this movie, okay? And um, it goes back to the Power Rangers in space, not not the TV show. It goes back to the Rangers. They're ninjas now, cause that lady could just they could just fucking do that. They're ninjas. Adam's a frog. And the funny part, where cause she's like going down the line and she's like, Aisha, like you know, as fist as a bear. So you're the bear. It's a skate park. Oh, this asshole. And she's like, oh, you know, you know. And then she's like, oh. Billy, you're clever like a fox. Then she's, and then she's like, goes to Adam. She's like, Adam, what's wrong? And he's like, oh, I'm a frog. You know, it's funny because that was shit. Don't laugh. That was ad libbed by Johnny Young Bosch. It was great. But uh, I don't have to fight that guy. I realize I can just leave, right? Wait, I can just walk out, right? I can't. That guy's the slowest runner. So yeah, so then they get their fucking ninja powers, and then they gotta go, they gotta go uh, to this place to actually get their power coins back. It's a, it's a lot, okay. But the cool part, they have a cool fight scene. Tom, hey, it's Alpha Five. What are you here for? Okay. So, um, how do I, how do I fucking get coins? You can get buffs and shit. Whoa, wait, whoa! This game's way, way deeper than I thought it was. How did I get any of this shit though? Okay, no, I can't, I can't do, I can't do any of that stuff. Anyways, oh shit, nothing's messed up. Was that Rita on the screen? Yeah, it's Rita, yeah. So, anyways, they go, they uh, get to go to a movie. I want to go movie. How did he hit me with from that fucking far, dude? Shit. I gotta kinda pay attention right now, I'm probably gonna die here. No, bitch! You guys should be dead, like, come on, you're making the rules, you're making the rules. Okay. So then, um... Uh, what movie are they watching? Where the fuck you guys come from? Shit! 
Shit, dude! Oh. So then, uh, what was I talking about? So they fight these, they fight this dinosaur bone, and then Tommy's like, hey, I got a bone to pick with you. And he takes out his neck bone, and it just, it just collapses, it just, it just fucking dies. And so after that, they go and they fight these, like, rock, rock gorillas? I don't know how to, they're like rock gorilla dogs, and like suits of armor, and it's like low-key intense, because like, I used to stuck in, god damn it, she's stuck in a corner, and like, they have their axes, and they're just like jabbing at her. And, but of course, Tommy, like, is the only person to realize, hey, we have fucking ninja powers, so he does an ninjetti corkscrew kick and just destroys him. He's like, eight block, corner pocket, and hits a wall. And then that wall they hit just so happens to release their powers, and they get their suits back. And they fly all the way back to Earth. And then they get in the Megazords, their new Zords. And, um, uh, there's nothing in there, okay. They get in their new Zords. And they go fight Ivanus, and they they beat up the Zords, and it's like super crazy and shit. They blow up the fucking uh, I think it's the guild. They kill the Ant One. God damn it! They kill the Ant One, but uh, the Wasp or B One is is way is way stronger because Ivanus like in, literally and in, gets like he literally merges with the machine, and uh. Like, oh no, so we gotta merge, you know, we gotta do our fucking Megazord shit. And so they do it. And it's a crazy Megazord, because the first time seeing it. And the, by the way, these Zords are full CG. Full, like, 19. Damn it! You just are from the beginning? Wow. That's bullshit. Well, let me get back to where I was before, and then I'll, I'll, I'll continue to tell you guys. The, the movie. Uh, I'll, I'll back here. So what was, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, the Power Rangers movie. So after uh, Ivan Ooze gets into this fucking Ant, Ant Megazord, they combine do their Megazord shit, and um, hold on, fucking, I gotta pay attention here. Let me throw his ass. So after that, they fight. And it's fucking crazy, man. Cause then like the parents are there too, but they're all mind possession shit. So it's like this one annoying kid. He's like wants to be a Power Ranger, but obviously he's not gonna be a Power Ranger. So they get him like on their Power Ranger. But anyways, he's like stopping his parents from going over a gorge or some shit like that. But the crazy part is that um, they're all on a train for some reason, and Tommy has to save them. So he departs from the Megazord and he goes and saves them because you know Tommy's the best and saves everyone. But then uh, while he's doing that, they're having trouble with Ivan News and the Megazord. So Tommy comes back, they go to fucking space, right? Like, they're in space. Like, they're fighting in actual space. And so, uh, fuck you. Piece of shit. So then, uh, they're like, oh, man, we're not going to be able to do it. And they're like, hey, there's a, there's a convenient comet coming around this time of year. And they're like, okay, cool. Set a course for the comet. And then, uh, they go to the comet, and then Ivan Ooze is like, you guys can't beat me. And they're like... And so he like latches onto them and he's like holding onto them and they're like in like a fucking like they're locked up they can't move and the asteroids come in or a comet or whatever's coming and so then they're like oh man we're gonna do this and Aisha's like don't worry about it we're uh we'll be fine and she hits the emergency button and it needs Ivan News in the groin and he's like oh shit you know he shouldn't have her groin because he's in a robot body and um he gets smashed by the comet and dies like straight up just just fucking dies and so uh the power just you go back they go back to zordon it's just supposed to be like the juice bar oh fuck this dude i'm gonna find two of you guys i guess i am this guy's so annoying like stop with the whipping shit bro it's not cool oh my god like what the fuck dude stop that shit It's annoying. It's not. It's not. It's not nice. And the thing is, though, like, shit. The thing is, I can't get on the same level as him because it, this game is so weird. So, it, like, it lets him start up. I don't understand. It lets him start even if you punch him. He's invincible while you punch him. It's fucking weird. But yeah, that's the movie. Uh, they go back and Zordon. They like, they like combine their powers and bring him back to life. 
I mean, it's a, it's a fucking, you know, it's a kids movie, so you know, let things slide. But yeah, that movie was great. I don't think this new one's gonna be as good. I'm just saying. Oh, I'm done with this part. Yes, cool. <laughs> what if my health regenerates though, like in between sections? The fair brawl. Did it regen? No, it didn't. Whoa, what the fuck is this? Is that the Tengu from the movie? Oh, yeah, the movie, by the way, it was like kind of like the bridging for the seasons because after that see, movie came out, they got the Ninjetti powers in the TV show, but in a completely different way. Yeah, I'm pretty sure these are the Ivan Ooze monsters, dude. These are the crows. Like, see how they, 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 they like, fucking turn into, like, purple goo? All right, figure that shit out. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta kick him upwards. Yeah, they go whoop like that. Like, see the watch whoop, and then you beat him up, bitch. That's how you do it. You gotta kick him, and then bam, bam. They're weak though. See that couple of hits? It's like bam. See? Out of here, bitch. Why'd your head hurt? There we go. Ow, you sucker punched me. Here. Guess what? Guess what? Going for a swim. I think we're just getting a lot faster. So I don't know what's going on. Nope. Not. Yeah, I can get me. Come on, baby. Get in here. Ray. Come on. Come on. Fucking. Just grab him, dude. He's right there. There we go. Oh, you bitch. No, I'm not giving you a chance to do nothing. Get out of here. Oh, the music is getting fat. Oh, this guy. It's gonna keep... Keep doing that. You should die soon. There we go. What the fuck? Why are you suddenly immune to shit? Come on, baby. The shitty part is like you die in this game, it's like some Dark Souls shit. Like you die, you gotta go you gotta go all the way back, you lose your experience and everything. It's crazy. Alright, we're done here. Alright? Or right, some like random boss gonna appear. Okay. Get ready for what? Oh my god. So you can't even dodge that shit, huh? Like I'm trying to dodge and I can't. So as long as you hit him with the up kick thing, you can hit follow up whenever. Oh my god, you guys are fucking annoying, dude. There we go. Right, I need to destroy some shit to get some health. Give me something to blow up, please. Oh, yes, are that. What's this shit? Oh, it's a bounce house. Cool. Shit, I got hit. Not cool. Hey, buddy, come down here. Why aren't they jumping? Why am only I jumping? Like, I'm not even pushing the jump button. But once you see, like, why only a certain amount jumping when I'm on the same level as them and I'm I'm jumping? Let's see if I can like infinite air juggle them though. This is way more difficult than need to be. Just, 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 just telling you that right now. You gotta be a way skilled gamer to play this game. This is not for children. This is like the Dark Souls version of Power Rangers. <laughs> Which I guess it'd be like Power Rangers in space, because that's pretty dark too. That's pretty dark. 
Hell, one of the characters' name was Dark Conda. Like, don't get much darker than that. And he has like nine lives. I think he was like a cat person. I want to say. They got me fighting these all annoying characters at once, dude. Come on, man. Like for real. All right. It's the, the most annoying guy here is the whip, dude. Cause like, like these guys, I can figure it out easy. Like it's fucking just up kick him. Like that was easy, you know what I mean? But it's like, fucking whip, bro. Like calm down, man. Cause like, he gets these invincibility frames. Like you see. Oh my god, like sometimes I'm trying to run and it doesn't run, so it's just like, bitch, stop it! There we go. Like, I want to do that attack in order to stop him, but like, it doesn't always do that shit because it's not in the same level. But I've said it like a billion times already. Oh, that was it. Oh, thank God. Please be the Megazord battle now. Clash on the coast. These are... These are so fucking long, dude. What the shit? I feel like I already played like eight zones. Oh, this is it. See, where, where's my... It's supposed to be a team, a team fucking thing. Where's my team? You know what I mean? Turban shell. Oh fuck, you guys just deserted me like that? Can I even hurt him? Like, can I hurt him? Okay, I can hurt him. Oh, of course! I'm trying to think what song this is. But I don't think it's a song. I mean, it's a song, but not from Power Rangers, like... But it kind of sounds like, uh... No. It just sounds like the kind of music they put, like, just around me in there. That's like a variation of the theme song, but not an actual song. How did I hurt you? What? What? What the fuck? There's two of them? That's not fair at all. How did fucking... He Where's my team at? That's what I want to know. Okay, so he's an invincible when he turns into ham, right? Oh, never mind. I got your number, bitch. I think. I don't know. I don't know where your weak points are, dude. I'm just randomly hitting. One of us is going to die here. And it's not going to be me, bitch. Ha 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 ha. Ah, I'm the green. I'm the, I mean, I'm the, I'm the white ranger. Get out of here. Get out of here! Get out of here! Get out of here! Should I move away? I'm probably away. I don't blow up. Don't y'all pose? I did all the work. I do think it's cool that you use original dialogue from the uh, the the TV show, though. That's pretty cool. The weird thing is though, is like, you can play as the White Ranger, but you don't get the White Tiger Zord? That's it's fucking crazy to me. We're racing this part, come on. We know what's gonna happen here. I gotta shoot and shoot, shoot. But I feel like the, the, it's just called like Mega Battle, but like you don't, you don't get to like, actually fight in the Mega Zord. Just a bunch of quick time events. And I'm like, that's weird, right? Like. They could have easily made it like an actual fight, like the Power Rangers old like SNES and Genesis games. You would actually fight in the fucking Megazord. You would fight in that shit. Like you fought as a, a ranger and you fought in the Megazord, and it was dope as fuck. How am I missing this? Like it's an easy target right there. Like I would think the Megazord battles would be like difficult. More difficult than the actual ranger battles, but playing as a ranger is way harder in this game. Like this is simple. It's like here's a big ass thing to shoot. Here's literal targets on his weak points. Don't miss. And you won't even fire at you while you're shooting him in like this in this, you know what I mean? Like 
But you fight as a ranger, and it's like you're getting fucked on all sides. And if you die, you start all the way from the beginning. There ain't no safe points for you, buddy. It's weird to me that, like... Like, it's weird that, like, you have to do the shooting part, too, because the Power Rangers, like, almost never didn't just go straight to a Megazord battle mode, you know what I mean? Like, it says fight, but it just, it just, it just button prompts. Like, it's just button prompts. You're not really fighting. Even though they could have just transferred over the fighting mechanics from the ranger portion of the game. It's like, it's just button prompts, like, oh, what? Why am I using my sword? Shit. Why am I using my sword, though, so early? You know what I mean? Like, you only use the power sword once, baby. That's when it's done. Ultra power mode. Fuck you. What? I have fucking light beams for my eyes? Like, all right, how do I do this? Just, you know what I mean? That's not really satisfying, though. Like, because, like, when you play with other people, like, I wonder, like, is it, like, do they control different parts? Like, do they get their own Zord? Like, what happens? Oh yeah, you gotta just, you somehow destroy these energy towers by killing uh, the monsters. Where did the Megazord go? Oh shit! Oh shit! We're running out of energy in our suits, y'all. Oh fuck! Another dimension. Okay, so I think this is where they're gonna tie into the movie. I mean, I don't know why you fucking have that, Kimberly, but I guess, yeah, maybe, like. I think it's fucking weird you have it, Kimberly, like. That's a recent mission before. Good point, Trini. God rest your soul. It's too far, man. A van, a bus, a plane. Who the fuck would have a bus or a plane, can't believe? Oh, I, I never mind. I am wrong here. <laughs> She's on my side. She's like, why is he even... He's just this random pilot at a fair. Yes, yes, I can. After all, you all saved me from the stage. It's the least I could do. There's time to fly out of here. Come on. Where's the 90 zingers, though? Like, come on. Where's, where's the zingers at? All right, well that's uh that's the third. That's high altitude. We'll do that in the next the next video. This is way longer than I thought it was gonna be, you guys. I'm sorry. Uh, maybe I will just break them up into like different parts. No, just keep them just keep them longer. It'll just be a short six episode series. All right, you guys. Uh, that thought's starting to hurt. So that's it for me. I'll talk to you later. Bye.